Okay, it's time for the Rachel tutorial, which I have not watched. So if I go a little bit slow, you know, it's a character, she's a character I really am not as familiar with as I would like to be. I used her a little bit in CT. She's less powerful in CS. Um, about way, way less powerful than she was in CS. She was one of the top characters in CT. She's considered the worst character in CS. That's before all the DLC and everything. That's that's arcade version, but still. You know, they say she's a character who, if she wins, is it's frequently by timeout. <laughs> that's not a good sign. Unique. That's a euphemism. That rose on the bottom, that's the gauge. It charges up with time. Okay, so Impish and is also called, is also called you know, the Pumpkin, and that's cool to circle back. Shoot, I hope I'm remembering all these moves correctly. Georgia 13th is the Frog, I, I believe that's cool to circle back plus C, and Gisophila is B. Yeah, I think. Yeah, so A goes the shortest, B is middle, and C goes the farthest. And they all have a little bit of a tra trajectory, so it's uh, trajectory changes accordingly as well between A, B, and C. You can hit people out of the air, even the little pod, which doesn't do much damage, but it can be frustrating, and it can, you know, we uh, whittle away at the life of the uh, of the opponents. So the lobelias, those are the light lightning rods, basically, on the ground. Okay, so that's pretty complicated. A sword iris basically sets off the um, lightning rods. The other way to set them off is with the uh, bottom bottom lily, the uh, distortion drive, which I won't be able to demonstrate because I won't be able to develop the heat unless I just instant block all day, and that would just be pretty boring to watch. Jump TC is that uh, floating move, kind of like Makoto's, but this is a lot slower. But it's got it also goes up higher. I don't even know what the back B animation looks like, but it's an overhead. Oh, it's probably the big fist. Yeah, I think it can. Yeah, we'll we'll we'll, we'll check it out. Specifically, we'll look at back B into standing B, standing C. Check out, check that that combo out. 
I can't really demonstrate block strings because Bang is not going to block during a um, tutorial mode. That's cool. Now that's the punch. That's the uh, cat punch or whatever they call it. Crouching C, that's the chair. Electric chair. That's a that, that can be a frustrating move to get hit by. For sure. Okay. A lot of stuff. Let's look at it back the whoops. Oops. That one I'm just trying to do. Hold on. <laughs> get away from stop. Stop. Okay, yeah, I was doing it right. So this is back B. So it is an overhead. Into B, C, okay? So watch. There, okay. Now, the other thing is, is okay, Tiny Labelias. I mean, oh, sorry, whoops. Tiny Labelias. The Sword Iris. Okay. Now, the jump. Down forward, C and D. Whoops. I'm hit one. There, see, that's kind of cool. Yeah, whoops. Oh, it's blocked, then you cancel it. Anti-air is, you know, it's cat punch. Whoa, that was cool. Can you jump cancel that into, I don't know. You need a 6D on me. Here's, here's cat chair. All right. Completely fighting the wrong way. Okay, so this is how you're supposed to fight this character. Come on. Boom. Electricity. Got hit by lightning. Silly bang. Ooh, thump. Alright. What else did I need to demonstrate? 2C. Oh, 6B. Oh, wait. 6C. 6C. Yeah, okay. This is, uh, this is good for trolling. It's, it's... Oh, no, it's not. I was thinking of jump 2C. You get a trophy if you hit someone with with six with six C forward C like th thirty times in a match or something. I don't understand. Then again, I don't know this character really well. So let's try that. Oh, well. why are you gonna do that combo again? The back B combo, which you're not really supposed to do from a, you're not really supposed to poke with back B. Unless, you know, you have them in the corner and you think they might block low and when they wake up or whatever, but, you know, I just wanted to see that, see what happened with that, because he's not going to block anyway. That's a pretty fast overhead, actually. It's kind of cool. I'll have to keep an eye out for it if I'm blocking low against Rachel's pressure. So the D is to uh, aim the, the tiny labelia a little bit, I suppose. Okay, so you can't just do a forward A jump cancel, like, but it looks like. Maybe you can, but but the typical, the one they provide, the combo they provide is forward A, standing B, then jump cancel. 
You know, maybe the standing bee is hitting them when they're already on the way up, but... Uh, that second jump seat is probably hitting them as they're falling down, I guess. I'll have to take a look at that. Oh, no, it's two jump cancels. That looks a little bit different from the previous slide, what they were just telling me. Jump cancel four would be C, jump cancel four would be C, then... Okay, I don't think that's what they were telling me in the previous slide, but this makes more sense. Probably I'm just confused. Let's see that wind pose then. Huh? 